Hey guys, this is Malinki. Welcome back to my channel, Voice of Malinki. Today we will talk about function of hemoglobin. And if you are new in my channel, please subscribe my channel. And if you like my video, please do like, comment and share my video. So in our last lecture, we have talked about structure of hemoglobin. And we have seen that the hemoglobin has two conformations, R state and T state. So oxygen has more affinity to R state and deoxyhemoglobin is present in T state. Now we will see the function of hemoglobin. So the main function of hemoglobin is to transport the gases. Transport of oxygen. The affinity of oxygen to hemoglobin is affected by pH 2,3-bisphosphoglyceric acid or 2,3-BPG, CO2 concentration and partial pressure of oxygen. Let's see what happens in alveoli that is in lung. So in lung, the pH is high, the concentration of CO2 is low, the concentration of 2,3-BPG is low and the partial pressure of oxygen is high that means they favor the R state which leads to binding of oxygen to hemoglobin. Next we will see what happens in tissue. So in tissue the pH is low, the CO2 concentration is high, the concentration of 2,3 BPG is high and the partial pressure of oxygen is low. So they all favor T state. That means it leads to the release of oxygen from hemoglobin. Every 100 ml of blood carries 5 ml of oxygen to the tissues. Next see the transport of CO2. 20 to 25 percent of CO2 is transported bound to hemoglobin. The affinity of CO2 to hemoglobin is affected by the partial pressure of oxygen and the partial pressure of CO2. So in the alveoli that is in the lung the partial pressure of oxygen is always high and the partial pressure of CO2 is always low. That causes the release of CO2 from hemoglobin. In tissues the partial pressure of oxygen is low and the partial pressure of CO2 is always high. That causes the binding of CO2 with hemoglobin. Transport of other gases. Hemoglobin also transports nitric oxide. Carbon monoxide also binds to hemoglobin. So this is all about today's lecture. I hope you liked the lecture. Thank you for watching my video.